If you're tired of queuing or haven't the time, Miss Estelle Kelway will queue for you. At her West End office, she and Miss Reed, who helps her, receive commissions to go shopping for people all over Britain and for members of the forces overseas. Every day, some of her 700 or more clients send her orders, not to mention money and coupons, for things they can't manage to buy themselves. When Miss Kelway started her career as a professional shopper, she had no idea what it would lead to. Now, apart from shopping for a living, she's quite used to being asked to do such other odd jobs as taking a client's dog out for a run in the park. made quite a nice bit of exercise for herself as well as the dog. Most of her day is spent standing still in queues, but then she gets paid for it. The things people ask her to get vary from furniture, ornaments, crockery and plate to other things that you have to wheedle out of the shopkeeper. A large part of her daily list is always devoted to shoes. Shoes of all shapes and sizes, colours and styles. Of course, most of these will turn out to be for display only when she gets inside but it's her job to do her best for her clients and she usually manages to get at least some of the pairs on order. Miss Kelway won't be put off with anything but the exact article her clients want, whether it's a wedding dress for a bride-to-be or a present that a wife once bought as a surprise for her husband. Women even trust her to choose the right hat for them, which says a lot for her judgment. What girl wouldn't like to be able to try on dozens of new hats a day? Or to go around taking flats and houses for people, until of course the agents tell you they've just been taken by somebody else. Miss Kelway has to make some pretty odd purchases at times. One of her clients has written to ask if she can find a nice little cabin cruiser. So she's gone down herself to find just the right one. Finding books gives our professional shopper a lot of hard work. People haven't time to spend hours looking through the second-hand shelves. And why should they, when she'll do it all for them? And when the day's over and the goods have been brought home, there's plenty more work to be done. Miss Reed, who also takes her share in the shopping, helps to account for the money and coupons and send off the purchases to their new owners. Here are some of the results of a day's work. Yes, it's worthwhile queuing if someone else will do it for you.